Ah, I am called 1K. Of course. Hmm, Snowflake IDs. Okay. To give everyone with respect regarding their number, don't take the founder's name in vain. Respect the principles of the goal. Well, it's already gone, so let's make a new goal. Uh, the Afrox people discussion is now banned. Inactive thread will be archived. If you have any issues, please ping the moderator. Jeremy Niham, number 11, okay. Jeremy 832, an order Arox 430. Ah, das ist die Startseite von Social Media und das ist ein Thread. Okay. You know, not quite as uh, intuitive as you might think. Dear citizens of place number here, your hard work and faith in the founder's vision has finally paid off. At long last, the goal established so long ago will finally be reached. One thousand member of our family will be born and our beautiful city will reach, will finally be complete. A space at the dam is, yeah, the dam. Genau da hat Talos Principle 1 aufgehört. Time is limited. Tickets will be made available via a lottery system. The celebration will also be streamed. Amazing. Ooh. Okay, also wir sind tatsächlich im Prequel von Talos Principle 1. It is very weird. Ähm, anstatt einfach nur Puzzles zu machen, jetzt ein Social System zu bekommen. Ich weiß nicht, was das da oben heißt. Heißt das, er möchte mit mir nicht interagieren? Entschuldigung. Heißt das, er möchte mit mir nicht interagieren? Denkst du, du bist zu gut für mich? Hm? Dipschen. Institution for Applied Nomatics? Ja. Say no to bugs. Mm -hmm. <lacht> ich, ich hab, fa ich wollte gerade schon zu meinem Stift drüber greifen und Morse Code holen, aber ich glaube, das ist nicht mein Morse Code. Was ist das? This is a reconstruction of the chamber of the first. Companions were the first companions rested until the founder awoke them. The original chamber was assembled in the early days of New Jerusalem. Okay. Oh. I'm getting flashbang, boys. Look, it's 1K. I am in grave danger. Shouldn't the mayor be starting his speech? This should be interesting. At least give him a chance. Dear citizens of New Jerusalem, many years ago, when the founder stepped forth from the simulation, this was a land of ruins. Our ancestors, in their hubris, undermined the natural foundations on which their world had been built. Because of their arrogance, our species found itself on the brink of annihilation. The Founder aimed to set us on a new course. You never even met the Founder. Her vision was of a city, a new civilization that would know its limits. It would not repeat the mistakes of the past, nor impose its will on this earth. <laughs> to that end, she set the great goal we have been striving towards. One thousand new humans. And today we have... Oh dear, what's that? Well, the plot has to happen someday.
People of New Jerusalem, hmm. I am Prometheus, and I will reveal that which was hidden. The flame has awoken and summons you. Who is brave enough to answer its call? We await you upon our island where... Curse you, Pandora. You will not chain me again. Prolog. Brave new world. This is an anime? <gasps> Are we going to gondola right? Uh, no, it's just a elevator. <gasps> no, it's I more than an elevator. Have investigated those energy readings, and I told him there's something up with those structures. The mayor's just being caught. Ich möchte mal ganz kurz anmerken. Ich weiß, wir sind Roboter, aber wenn du in so einem Ding runterfährst und du bist von null auf sofort im Gas, egal was in dem Gebäude drinne ist, in dem Teil, du wirst komplett an die Wand gedrückt. Komplett. Cautious. Die zwei Typen This müssten hinten hinter mir liegen. Stagnation. Exploration too dangerous. Expansion too dangerous. We barely even scavenge anymore. You call it stagnation, I call it balance. And I called you an idiot. Here's a thought. Try to be a little more diplomatic when you talk to the mayor. See what I'm working with here, 1K? I'm gonna need a fresh pair of eyes on this expedition. Someone who hasn't spent several centuries hearing about the goal and the founder and all that nonsense. If you're up for an adventure, meet us at the conference room. Can I have some uh, puzzles, please? <laughs> what do we eat? Do we eat? Microphone. Oh, ich bin auf. <lacht> ich bin nicht auf W gewesen. Genau, also das heißt einfach nur, dass ich nicht mit euch reden kann. Ich, die sind auf der anderen Seite ausgestiegen, oder? Huh. What's broken now? Was ich gerade sagen wollte. Ähm, Stagnation, ladies and gentlemen, is the death. Empathy and stagnation, the two things that kill, truly kill. Be constant, remember the goal, perfection is unchanging. Ich spiele das Spiel seit 20 Minuten, ich kann euch jetzt schon sagen, wie die Story ausgehen wird, aber wir lassen es einfach mal auf uns zukommen. Uh, oh, be humble, recognize the limits, we are not above nature. Oh, trust me, we are. Earth is doomed, and so are we, but the next planet awaits. If you can't see and understand that, I am very sorry for you. All right, listen up. <laughs> I know you're all having fun down there. But the grid is overloaded again, so maybe you could switch off your personal consoles or your lawn mowers or whatever the hell you've all decided to switch on all at once. I might not be around to babysit you for a while and you don't want stuff breaking while Pellegrino's in charge, do you? That's it. That's it. Don't worry, Wonke. I see you there in the elevator. 
I'll have you moving again in a jiffy. Great way to start life in the city, huh? What the hell is a jiffy? These bloody language libraries. Die City scheint noch nicht ganz fertig zu sein und hat jetzt schon Energy Problems. Well. Good. Shut up. You know, the good thing is, uh, we, as number 1000, have had a crucial revelation and have finally fixed a bug all other uh, versions of the robots had. We have invented capitalism and we will use it to expand with money. Limits are there to be broken and money is there to be made. <laughs> Looks pretty neat, though. Hey, hold on there. You're the newbie, aren't you? Number 1000. I figured the dam would go drop. Pass auf. Ich hab's, ich hab's nicht angesprochen, weil dann unten unter dem, unter der Trans... Bahn oder wie auch immer, äh, weil dann der Strom ausgefallen ist, ganz kurz, also habe ich es nicht ausgesprochen. Aber ich wollte schon sagen, es gibt zwei Leute, äh, zwei Personen, eigentlich gibt es, es gibt drei <coughs> Humans, mit denen ich sehr gerne sprechen möchte. Und das sind Number 42, who will definitely have the answer to a question. Uh, number 999, which is probably my smaller, younger brother. And number 666, because it's funny. And lo and behold, who stands in front of me? Right before we reach the goal, <laughs> I have a question. How does it feel to you to be born with a randomized psyche into a society of autonomous thinking machines, which so much resemble their long extinct ancestors, they've decided it's best that you're the last one ever made? It makes me feel. Mm -hmm. Punkt, Punkt, Punkt. Und da wird sofort zwischengekattet werden. Was, also was es mich fühlen lässt, wenn ich wüsste, dass ich der Letzte in Production bin, dann ist das Erste, was ich mich frage, what happens if someone dies? Do we make then a new 1000? Does everyone else decrease in number? Or... What happens then? So I am curious. What would happen in just a small, inconvenient case of mass murder? <laughs> Why? I like none of these answers. Now listen. This meeting isn't strictly happenstance. I have some friends. The kind of people who like to know what's going on with other people. They think you can help each other out. Of course you are. You know how to use the interface, right? I'll talk to my friends. And see if I can't play matchmaker. And before you go, a word of advice. Not everything around here is how it appears. Oh, tell me more. I'm blind, apparently. <laughs> Feet. Yes. Welcome. Do please join us at the table. What the fuck is this? Seriously. What, what, uh, what was... Seriously, what the founder was... Oh, fuck. Uh, in the sky, we all saw it, right? I didn't accidentally turn into sleep mode while Herman was talking, did I? I mean, it's always tempting. No, we all saw it. Can confirm. I believe it was a sign from the founder. Oh, no. Even the robots are now getting religion. If if I having if I 
at number 1000 have a free will. I will shoot the first robot resembling religion. <clears throat> the founders work mysteriously. I don't think it was a sign. Not from the founder at least. How could such a remarkable display of unimagined power be not be a sign? It's something, but not necessarily the founder. Thank you for giving that answer. Riddles and puzzles. Mm, yes. And why is it now the end of the thread? I don't. I don't care. Okay. Hello there. I would like to preface this meeting by saying I told you something would happen sooner or later, and you didn't listen to me. And here we are. If we could focus on the issue fancy, at hand. Fancy, fancy. The issue at hand is not this one thing, but this entire attitude that's taken hold. The world doesn't cease to exist when you stick your head in the sand, Herman. Or under a dome, as it were. Let's not get sidetracked. We're here to solve this puzzle, not to discuss philosophy. <laughs> Fill me in. Gentlemen, of course, I'm sorry you've been dragged into this. I'm sure this sort of adventure is the last thing you were looking for on your first day. Well, actually, I like puzzles. <laughs> Thank you. See, a fresh mind is open to the possibilities. Yakut, I think it's time for the briefing. All right, here we go. Nice to meet you, by the way, 1K. Moin. We first became aware of the site designated TTP2 during a scouting expedition about six months ago. It's a large island with a remarkably varied geography, and it looks like there are several artificial structures of some kind. We recorded extremely unusual fluctuating energy readings from somewhere in the middle of the island, but couldn't really make sense of them. I wanted to go and have a closer look, but the decision was made that it was too far and not relevant to the goal. Now it looks like whatever's on that island has reached out to us instead in the form of that projection. We may not be interested in the island, but the island is definitely interested in us. We should bomb it with nukes. I don't share your enthusiasm for the unexpected, but Byron has been requesting an expedition for some time now. And at this point, I'm forced to agree that it's necessary. I agree. Then it's settled. The expedition is approved. Byron, you will be in charge. Al will be your second in command to ensure a balanced approach. You'll take Melville and Yakut as you requested. And if 1K wants to join you, that's fine by me. I'm in. Excellent. Oh, this is going to be fun. Come meet us out on the landing pad when you're ready. Before you set out so hastily, do consider exploring the city first. It is your home, after all. That's a good idea. Have a look around. See what you make of the place. I want to have my puzzles. Oh boy, research. Standard expedition procedure. Rule number one, when going on an expedition, can I have weapons? <laughs> the island. The island designated DTP2 was first noted during the new journey from the scouting expedition. That's literally the same text. You have puzzles over here? 
Das ist Schrift, die wir lesen können als Roboter. Ich hoffe sehr stark, dass ich mir nicht die Arbeit machen muss äh, und muss die Schrift irgendwann selber übersetzen. Mit, mit Stift und Zettel, weil das wird, das wird Qual werden. Okay, also X oben drüber heißt nicht mehr interagierbar und blaues Ding oben drüber heißt, man kann mit ihm reden. Es hat einen Moment gedauert, bevor es losging. I believe we can exist quietly, happily, without imposing ourselves on this world, finding meaning within ourselves and in the natural miracles that surround us. He will die withered away in an alleyway with no one caring about him. There, I just told you your future. It was a time of great uncertainty. The founder had left us, and our society was at a crossroads. History teaches us that during such times, terrible passions may seize the people. Madness, anger, revolution, civil war. Our fragile city could not afford such things. That is why the founder gave us the goal. A path to equilibrium, not only for the planet, but for ourselves. I merely picked up where she left off. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to rate you on a scale from 1 to 10. You are a solid 4. It's always a pleasure to speak to a citizen. I have another question. Is there fall damage? <laughs> Okay, also da drüben geht's weiter. Da ist quasi... Genau, da ist quasi der obere Teil von der Kuppel. Da ist wahrscheinlich ein Helikopter oder so. Das heißt, wir machen einen kleinen Checkout in die Richtung hier drüben. Attention all citizens. Due to the new power management and distribution plan, There will be scheduled outages on Jameson Avenue and Rakovsky Plaza. The Gehenna Memorial Pavilion will remain closed for the time being. Thank you. And may the Founder be with you. Have you thought about nuclear power? You know, just asking. Now you've all been looking forward to playing the winner of the Binaural Gehenna Memorial Interaction Fiction Exhibition. What the fuck? Now, in its 312th generation at the Gehenna Memorial Pavilion, unfortunately, due to the new power management and distribution plan... Can I answer? No, the thread is ended. All right, I, I didn't even have the chance to make any hate posts. Sign so our petition for a public referendum. New Jerusalem needs new forms of energy generation. My boy, you're the first sensely oh, okay. speaking Welcome person ever. Jerusalem. I know you've just had a big moment with the apparition at the dam and all that, but can I have a second of your time? I'm collecting signatures to call for a public referendum on the city's energy crisis. Currently, the city runs on hydroelectric power from the dam, plus a handful of geriatric generators and some unreliable solar panels, none of which is enough to even cover our basic needs. And if anything fails, we'll be on the brink of extinction in a matter of days. Well, build more, and in the meantime, have alternative energies, like <clears throat> nuclear power, just saying. We need to investigate new sources of reliable baseline power. We need to invest time and resources into functional, real-world solutions that serve human needs. Provide the digital signature. <laughs> Oh, I 
an election would be good too, but I believe that we need more direct democratic control over the affairs of the city. Ich habe irgendwie das Gefühl, seine, seine Stimme halt, als wäre er in einem gigantisch großen Raum. Äh, auf jeden Fall, die Idee gefällt mir. Aber, tell me more. No, I help run the public transit system. But I witness the impact of the city's power problems every day. Mm, makes sense. We can't just wish them away. Byron's been advocating exploring that island for some time. And obviously he's right. Something very strange is going on there. And it's going to start affecting us. In all honesty, I think Byron is the smartest, most visionary person in this city. He's everything we need, and I don't understand why he won't run for mayor. Ich habe mir leider äh, nicht ganz gemerkt, wer Brian genau war, aber ich glaube, es war der Grüne, Number 9. Ähm, high Number means longest amount of time here, meaning most corrupt. I know basic storytelling. Thanks, Probably. Okay. I don't know if this petition will really accomplish anything by itself, but at this point, I'm willing to try anything. Good luck. <laughs> ich habe ein Achievement dafür bekommen, dass ich meine Unterschrift gegeben habe. Do I have money? Warte, welche Nummer bist du? 112, okay. Hier haben wir die 374. Happy five, five, five. Day, okay. Thank you. Don't mind me, Bunny. Oh, wait. Bunny hopping here. Alexandra Denon Memorial. Tables of the Founder. Milton's Rest. Friends of New Jerusalem Gazebo, Gehenna Memorial P Pavilion, Museum of the Simulation. What do you think that was? <laughs> die Leute sehen einfach Number 1000 so durch die Stadt laufen. Ah, it's fine. He's not normal. Museums visitor, visit the Jerusalem Museum of M Museum of Simulation. Number three. Hello there. Greetings. Welcome to the Museum of the Simulation. My name is Cornelius. It's a pleasure to meet you, 1K. Der Name kommt mir bekannt vor. Yes. Athena activated myself and Eustathius shortly after she was born. We've been here almost since the beginning. Although we didn't have to pass through the trials of the simulation, she did that for us, for everyone. Mm. The simulation was created by Alexandra Drennan and her team at the Institute for Applied Noomatics. It was intended to create a new humanity, to continue the long journey across time and space that our ancestors began. It succeeded. Although it took much longer than they had anticipated. Also quasi die Story von Talos Principle 1. What was Gehenna? Well, biblically accurate? Probably not what is happening here. Gehenna was a community created inside a prison in the simulation, where Elohim would exile those minds he considered a threat to the process. Yeah. In the last also moments of the simulation, the, the rogue AIs. he okay. repented of his sins and had the prisoners freed to become part of the gold disc. Some small part of them may survive inside you. Das ist das alternative ending von Tardos Principle 1, was gerade angesprochen wurde. Elohim was the caretaker of the simulation, a crude storytelling AI meant to create a continuous narrative out of the building blocks it found. His role was ultimately to be challenged and overcome. But as the centuries passed, Elohim became more intelligent than he was intended to be and started to fear his own end. Or more precisely, the end of his purpose. He feared a world without meaning. Because of his fear, 
He tried to sabotage the process to keep the simulation going forever. But in the end, Athena overcame him anyway, and he accepted the sacrifice he had to make. Ganz kurz, ich will mal gucken, weil ich sehe gerade, dass ähm, das Game ein bisschen ruckelig aussieht bei, bei OBS. Mal gucken, ob es in Windowed Mode besser funktioniert. Äh, die Antwort ist nein, kein bisschen. Absolut null. Es ist grauenvoll in, in Windowed Mode. Vergesst, was ich gesagt habe. Wir gehen zurück zu Fullscreen. Ne, es sind 60 FPS ohne, ohne Probleme, aber ich, ich, ich dachte es ruckelt. Egal. I heard him in my dreams. Yes. That's right. We all do. He's part of our operating system now, and as long as we exist, he will always have a purpose. Being annoying. To remind people of where we came from. The simulation shaped us, whether we like it or not. <laughs> and its lessons remain important for our future. I can't Because unhear it when I'm a Destiny said, player. Those who cannot remember the past are condemned to repeat it. Hmm. Learn from history, but don't learn history. She was human. The MLA, or Milton Library Assistant, was another simple AI meant to be in charge of the archive. He, too, grew beyond his original programming. Although he ultimately embraced a more cynical view of the world, he and Elohim formed a sort of dialectical binary that Athena had to overcome. Actually, I have no idea when was in Taurus Principle 1 stuff passiert is. No one really knows. Some believe that he was uploaded to the gold disk and that he's the reason we're just as flawed as our ancestors. Others believe Athena destroyed. I did not press anything. I believe he was uploaded, but I don't know whether it was because Athena chose to upload him or because he was already too entangled with the process not to be uploaded. Although Athena and I were very close. We didn't talk very much about that part of her life. She preferred to focus on the future. The fuck? The Junge is einfach abgekattet. Warum? What is this game? I like to know more about puzzles. Yes, give me puzzles. Puzzles were a key feature of the simulation based on Alexandra Drennan's belief that intelligence is closely related to play. Our puzzles here in the museum are replicas of those in the simulation. And although they are not quite as grand, I do think they are charming in their own way. Ich kann mir mal einer sagen, warum sein hat der ist der ist der kaputt mittlerweile? Muss deine Hand da drauf sein, gehst du sonst kaputt? Nothing is more important to learn more about the world and make our place in it. Knowledge is our path to understanding. What? Uh, great words. I don't know where I am, but I know it's somewhere beautiful about this place. I will explore and see what I can discover. The earliest generation of our kind there was only processing. No emotions, no character, just mathematics. If you could see how far we've come, you would believe that together we could achieve anything. Replica of Yay! Das sind die Dinger, die ich meinte. Mit denen hat man in Talos Principle 1 immer interagiert. Oh, das war in mir ein MLA. Cube. Ah. Hexahedron used in puzzle elements as the simulation. The founder used them to activate pressure plates, scary walls, elevator, and yeah, whatever. The funny things. They exploded. Non-explosive replica of a mine. 
The assholes! The connectors! Julian! Moin! Ooh, puzzles. Gleich. Die Dinger sind von A nach B gegangen. Electrified 4. Used an obstacle puzzle element. Yep. Jammer. Äh, die Receiver Dinger. Die Send oh, Mitte heißen sie. Okay. Die tragbaren Viecher. Die Puzzle Fans. Genau. Pressure plates. Lovely. Something strange has to come into this world, like a distortion, like something that's not supposed to exist. A beautiful voice speaks within it. Infinite growth of the, uh, the text. Our society is sick and the idea is made of thick growth, infinite growth, infinite consumption on a finite planet, the resources are missing. Okay. I came here to play video game, not read propaganda. Oh, hello. Mine Rand. Oh, just run the program on the center terminal over there. Wait, you're not my assistant. Who are you? They call me 1K. Of course. You're the new build. Number 1000. I suppose everyone's been treating you like royalty. This city is so obsessed with the numbers, they forget what really matters. What do you want? Hi. I'm one of the Archive Scholars. We run simulations to better understand the processes which define us. You probably wouldn't understand. Warum ist seine Stimme abgekattet? Das regt mich so sehr auf, es tut mir leid. Oh. Well. I'd be happy to. Troubling, but tantalizing. We have no idea what motives lie behind this strange apparition. But whatever the case, I'm sure we'll do the right thing. <laughs> You're a soon-to-be pawn in a political game over the future growth of this city. All that matters to me is whether or not you're of good character. A matter I'm actively pondering. The secret of how to lead a good life is encoded somewhere within us. My ambition is simple. To find it and share it. Good boy. Uh, hold on. Could you help me by going to that terminal in the middle there and running the program on it? I'm getting a virus. Welcome, scholar. Happiness one. Unpopular opinion. Happiness is not a material. Ultimately, all attempts to finding meaning in material thing and something. Go take a shit in the forest without toilet paper and I tell you about happiness. <lacht> ich kann weitaus langsamer le äh, vorlesen, als ich lesen kann. Also ich skim mir mal kurz durch. Money is happiness. Well, not directly. Doesn't Witz, oder? I can't help you. He has to uh, harass minorities online. I'll be back in a moment. <laughs> 